Now, I don't know if y'all heard or not. I know some people have, some people haven't. But the NBA, they're having their inaugural in-season tournament this season, 2023-2024 season. Now, I don't know if you know about it, but if you don't, I'm here to help. I'm here to guide you, and I'm going to get you right. Like, comment, subscribe if you're new. No nonsense. Let's get into what this in-season tournament pretty much is going to be like and how it's set up, the formatting, and how it's going to run. Let's go. Now to kick it off, the season tournament, it tips off on November 3rd. So just a couple of days after the season begins. Like I said before, the tournament consists of group play before you even get to the tournament stage, the knockout play. With regard to group play and how it works, all 30 teams, they were randomly drawn within their conference based on last year's record. Each team will play four designated group games, one on the road against each opponent in their group, two at home and two on the road during NBA's tournament nights, which will be every Tuesday and Friday from the 3rd of November all the way to the 28th and of course they don't play on election day so that's going to be the only Tuesday they don't play during that time period. Now for a while when I was hearing about this in-season tournament I was wondering how it was going to be less confusing with regard to what games are group play and what games aren't and to make it easy the NBA has made it to where the games from the 3rd to the 28th if they're played on a Tuesday or Friday they're a group game. No other NBA game will be played on those days so this does clear up any confusion with regard to what game counts towards the tournament rankings and what doesn't tuesday games friday games from november 3rd to november 28th then after you get past this group play stage we got the knockout round for the knockout round i would say this is more of the tournament aspect to it like i said AU travel ball we all know there's group play so that you can see it in the tournament so it is a tournament from the beginning but the knockout round it feels most tournament like because it is single elimination from this point forward now only eight teams will make it to the knockout round and the team with the best standing in group play in each of the six groups will be in the knockout round and the other two teams it will be teams that are from each conference with the best record in group play games that finish second I'm gonna show you guys a graphic of what the actual group play looks like like, but it's pretty much divided into conferences east and west and then you have your groups the groups are sort of like divisions, so to speak but it's not their actual division teams honestly it's like a rework of the nba divisions that's the best way to put it just for a month or so i kind of just put the group play draw in layman's terms but if you really want to see exactly how they determine it these are the